Okay guys, I am back with what could be possible Destiny 2 subclass hints. Uh, but before we get into the video, if you guys do enjoy it and want to be in with a chance of winning either a Destiny 2 beta code or the Resurrectionist emblem, simply drop a like and leave a comment down below. Okay, so getting into the video, a Reddit user by the name of Boldwing uh, brought this to everyone's attention and I, that Reddit link can be found within the video description. Available to buy under GameStop website are some Destiny 2 merch. We have three hats, each representing one of the three classes, Hunter, Warlock and Titan. Check out the designs on these hats, that's what's important here. On the Hunter we have like a snake themed logo. On the Warlock we have some kind of winged creature and on the Titan we have what looks to be a lion or a lynx. Now there has been loads of speculation into what these could mean and 99% of that speculation points towards new subclasses within Destiny 2 and I personally think the same. Destiny has some mythical creatures tied into its lore, maybe within Destiny 2 we'll see more of it. Now according to Elite back in February, a guy who claimed to be a Bungie employee, he said things that tied in and seem to be far more legit now than what they did back then. Now this leak was originally posted on Fire Den, which you will find linked within the video description if you want to read through all as well. Now he started his post talking about Destiny 2's story and said the following. The Kabul Empire in a moon sized war world shows up with his elite red guard and they level the tower. Now we all know this now is legit as Gary and the Red Guard destroyed the tower and the last city so he was spot on there. He also states the following and this ties into this video. New specs for classes include pet classes, titans get a lynx type creature, hunters get a large slinking reptile and warlocks get an alien raven type flying creature. I mean that's just too much of a coincidence, it really is. I mean as crazy as it sounds I actually loved the idea the first time of me reading this but never in a million years thought it would actually become possible and actually happen. And still now I doubt it's what we will see but hey I for damn sure hope I'm wrong and I will find out next week at the Destiny 2 reveal and as always guys I will have you guys covered here on my channel with what I am able to capture. But yeah pet classes is what he states, Titans get a Lynx type creature, just like what we see on this new Destiny 2 hat from GameStop, Hunters get a large slinking reptile, again ties in, and Warlocks get an alien raven type flying creature, again ties in, I mean the coincidences here, well they don't really seem like coincidences anymore and seem more to be factual. Now me personally, I think what these animals just represent are the classes we use. I mean all three animals kind of do match the nature of the classes. Eagle or bird conveys the powers and messages of the spirit. Snakes, stealth, quick viciousness, strike on a pinhead. And lions, quick yet extremely powerful. And they have tied into our classes before. As we see on the Destiny 2 poster we see a titan with what seems to be that very same lion crest on the chest piece he is wearing. Warlocks and the leaked subclass image we saw way back sees a warlock with what looks to be wings. Although wings can be seen on the Sun Singer subclass as it's a reference to a phonix. And from Destiny 1, snakes have been tied in with hunters as we see the venom cloak as well as a few other things. So yeah, these creatures have tied into our subclasses within the past. And me personally, I ain't throwing pet subclasses out the window as it's something I would love to actually see and it would be something new. But I just have a feeling if they're going to be anything, they will be animations from our subclasses where maybe we pop air super or any other ability. Who knows? But yes, all the speculation at the moment, nothing has been confirmed by Bungie. Next week, like I said, hopefully I will find out uh, while I'm in LA recording Destiny 2 and I will have you guys covered right here on my channel with all that juicy new footage I am able to capture. Now on the GameStop website, there are also keychains available with these symbols on them, which you will see on screen now. But yes, guys, tell me down below in that comment section what you think about these possible new subclasses. Do you think they 
will be in fact subclasses or tied into our subclass somehow or will they be something else let me know thanks as always though for stopping by subscribe if you're new around here and enjoy daily destiny videos hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to turn on them email notifications so you never miss a video and i will as always guys see you on that next one Thank <laughs> you.